Hi, this is JP from Not The Lights Over Arkham. This time I wanted to make a short video and uh, the video topic is the uh, Arkham Horror LCG novellas and the cards that come with them, so let's get started. So this far we have gotten seven different novellas. Uh, we have one with uh, Roland Banks starring as the lead <laughs> investigator. Then we have uh, one with uh, Jenny Barnes, one with Silas Marsh, one with Caroline Fern, uh, one with Norman Withers, one with uh, Dexter Drake, and uh, the latest one is one starring Gloria Goldberg. So, um, right off the bat, if you're only interested in the stories, uh, you might want to wait for the collected um, novella that has all of them in it. I think FFG is releasing that later. I, I'm not sure if it's this year or next year, but soon. So if you're just interested in the stories, get that one. Uh, but um, these are sometimes in print and available and if you're interested in the alternative art cards and the replacement cards then let's talk about those a bit more um, just uh, the stories in them are all decent i've enjoyed every one of them maybe my favorite uh, is the, either the dexter drake one or I also enjoyed uh, the Silas Mars one quite a bit and the Carolyn Fern one is also one of my favorites. The other ones are really good also, so nothing uh, wrong in those. But talking about the replacement cards, uh, if you're uh, struggling with Roland Banks' uh, usual cards, I re highly recommend getting the Roland Banks one. It is the Dirge of Reason. Uh, this is because uh, the replacement cards are actually much better than the cards that come in uh, the core sets. Uh, the Jenny Barnes replacement cards are not that good. You actually get a nasty um, enemy and the Greenman medallion is not that good as the Jenny's Twin 45 Automatics. So if you're just looking for replacement cards for Jenny, maybe skip that one because that's not that good. Then uh, Silas Mars replacement cards. Mm, these actually are really good. Uh, the weakness is not that bad and Nactual Prowess, Prowess is really good. And you actually can run those. Uh, with the ones that come in the InSmart Conspiracy box. Uh, Carolyn Fern, I would get it just for the alternative art because that's much better than the um, one that comes in the Circle Undone box. But the uh, uh, signature asset and the weakness are for it, so <laughs> I use those so seldom i i prefer the ones that come in the circle and done box uh, norman withers uh, we still haven't received norman's uh, signature cards but we are getting them in the edge of the earth expansion that is coming later this fall or this year and uh, these are not that bad the split the angle and vengeful hound are not that not that bad usually i can deal with those pretty the with the weakness pretty well, but uh, we will see if the uh, listed signature cards are better. So uh, maybe pick up Norman Withers after you have seen what the actual signature cards do, if you're just interested in the cards. Uh, Dexter Drake's um, signature ally and signature weakness are uh, really Good. Molly is a really good uh, signature ally, and Yastarot is a really uh, soft weakness. 
and usually I play Dexter with cards that come in the Instant Conspiracy box and with the replacement cards combined because the Molly is so good I always want to have Molly in the deck when playing Dexter. The last one is Gloria Goldberg and uh, Gloria's signature ally isn't that great. I haven't played that onto the table that much, usually just using it for the icons. And uh, the weakness is really weak, especially when you're playing in true solo. I usually never put cards underneath Gloria, so the signature weakness is just a dead draw and gets shuffled back into the deck usually, most of the time. But uh, uh, when we get Gloria's uh, real signature cards, um, I might see what those do and maybe use those instead, but I also really like Gloria's uh, card art, so that is one reason to get, <laughs> get the novella. But um, to sum it all up, uh, one of the key uh, replacement cards to get this Roland Banks. The other is Dexter Drake and Silas Mars as a strong third one. The others are not that important but if you can't wait for the Edge of the Earth get Norman Withers and Gloria I suggest to get because we are not getting Gloria anytime soon because next Edge of the Earth comes out and we still don't know when the campaign app box after that comes out so yeah, uh, that is basically it. Uh, this was meant to be a really short video and I'm trying to keep it at, at that. Not going to talk about the stories. Only thing I'm going to say is that every one of them is worth reading, either separately or getting the big novella with all of them included later. And I uh, uh, hope this short video gave you some idea if you are planning on getting some of these novellas just for the replacement cards um, maybe you get an idea on which ones you should get but if you're a collector of course get all of them because uh, all of the replacement arts are really worth it hope you guys like this uh, video thanks for watching and until next time